today we shall reflect on the life of saint john francis regis saint john francis regis was born on 31st of january 1597 at fontevonverte in nocumbre france very early in life under the gaze of his devout parents jean a successful merchant and marguerite de cugunhan he developed a keen interest in study and prayer he began formal studies at the jesuit college at bezies at the age of 14 and joined the jesuits at the age of 19 and was ordained to the priesthood at the age of 33 he then proceeded to spend himself in caring for the plague stricken of the city of toulouse thenceforth until his untimely death at the age of 43 he labored selflessly and with extraordinary success at missions among the ignorant farming population and the children of the poor in that section of southern france corrupted by the religious wars he converted numerous huguenots established confraternities of the blessed sacrament and saved wayward women from vice by providing refuge where they could learn an honest trade in the interest of the poor he broke the stranglehold which a few greedy men had on the grain market and got certain exorbitant taxes which threatened to ruin the local lace making industry removed his own life was one of great and continuous mortification as well as of absolute obedience to his superiors who had him give up some of the most cherished and ambitious charities because they were unable to share his own optimism and utter reliance on providence he died on the 31st of december 1640 and was canonized by pope clement the 12th in 1737 the mortal remains of saint john francis regis lie entombed in the basilica of la lovas it was to a pilgrimage to his shrine that saint john baptist mary vianney the cour des arts ascribes his vocation and his accomplishments